So I'm out in the garden this early morning, just a little bit after sunrise, and look what I found. I come over to my most amazing garden art teepee where I have planted some cantaloupe and Armenian cucumbers to grow up on the trellis. And then on the other side, I've planted a few watermelon. And then around these empty ones, I've planted cow peas. Red Ripper, I think is the name. Super excited about it. And then over here, I planted cucumbers and this bare area around these branches, these posts. So I'm out checking on them to see if anything sprouted yet. And what do I see? Look at all of this. Have you ever seen peas that sprout like this? <laughs> Okay, so what are these? And look, I've got loads of them over here. I didn't plant those, okay? I wouldn't have planted them that close. It's like you dumped the package of seeds or something, right? And look. Look, this is like coming up like, like I would have planted it around the post right there. Same thing. Then there's another one over here. And then even got some way back here. So clearly I didn't plant in there. So I pull out a few and look at this. Do you see the roots? It's a lentil. I mean, doesn't that look like a lentil? How the heck did lentils get over here? Now, you could say food scraps, but I didn't put any food scraps over here, for real. What this is, this area here is over a mostly bare spot in the front yard where they cut down a sweet gum tree. So there's the remains of that trunk and then nothing growing around it. Um, and so I put in some clay soil right kind of down in the center area. Then I harvested over in this whole area all around under the dark compost is where I put layers of the pile that I'm harvesting from over on the hunting grounds, which is just like a breaking down pile of, you know, wood chips and, and all leaves and all that stuff in there. And then I actually put some leaf mulch. You can see all that right there. And then I put compost on top of it. Same compost I'm putting everywhere. And I'm not seeing these pop up everywhere. But lentils? Like what kind of wild thing is, comes from a lentil? Or that looks like a lentil seed? So interesting. So now I have to let some grow. And now I wonder like, do I need to let them all grow? Because the rule is volunteers you let grow. Is this like an edible crop that I want to have that's here? I mean, I don't know, this is interesting. If I pull them and just leave a couple to then see what they are, what if it's something like way cool and then I destroyed most of them? So I don't know, what do you guys think? Let's, get the, let's see if I can get it to focus again on this. Look at that. I mean, what else could it be but a lentil? I don't know. And then look at these guys. They're not coming up like, like, you know, the original weeds from the seedling. I mean, these are coming up very unique right from the get-go. But it is a mystery. So exciting.